I want balls of steel. This is like balls of bronze. They're still hard. You still got big balls, but um, they could be even harder. I've got to show you some cool Viper tech. Wait, after the new patch, if you turn Bloom on and you use purple, I saw this on Dopey's stream last night. Credit to Dopey. These guys are glow in the dark on purple with Bloom. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we're defaulting a B wall. On pistol round box, uh, when we're rushing A, I really like the A Rafters orb I showed in my Viper guide, by the way. Remember my rule, Fox? So you're sus of this back gen angle, right? What's my rule? When you're in the smoke and you're sus of a corner, you just shoot it. You don't peek out and check it first, you just shoot it. Okay? I'm cutting. One, one screens, one screens. One rafters. Chamber rafters. Yes, be careful. We have to choose our battles. These fights are all bad for us with their classic pistol. I don't think I'd ever catch myself in this angle. So we're hitting A this way. If I'm gonna come out back site, I'll shoot that angle, right? Uh, might come here and fight rafters close with my classic. Maybe even like jumping, right clicking like this. Playing real tricky. You could even crouch over here and look to take space this way at the right time. Classic pistol, we have to uh, get a little creative. Because this fight here that we take is um, very suboptimal, right? Probably the worst fight we could find with our classic. And this fight's not too good either. Perfect. Jess, no man. I don't care that we missed that shot. We found a really good fight for our gun and we played with the team. Ray snowman still. Molly that shit. So spamming the smoke with Marshall is probably our first incorrect decision this round, right? It's a good round from us though, I like that. Yeah, and we should be lurking mid a lot this game, Vox. And I hope you can tell me why. Yeah, specifically lurking mid. And yeah, it's because they have no initiator. And this orb here it becomes really powerful if they have no means of collecting information on the other side of it. It basically forces them to walk down tube. It's like their only good option. Love this. We cashed out though. Um, I would love it even more. We're diamond two. We're getting close to ascendant of mortal. This guy's not looking at us. Just start shift walking up. Have the confidence that you can cash out if he starts turning to look at you. Nice shots. Nice shots. I would back up. These guys just shot at you with a sheriff and a stinger. It's a good round. No way. Don't worry about that, Vox. Do not worry about that. What we should worry about is we didn't leave after we saw their on eco. We've got numbers. And uh, we started our mid lurk so late into the round. Yeah, now I put that wall down. Our poison matters a lot here. Oh yeah, walk through, walk through. Um. Okay, this is just a confidence thing. You'll learn. But what I really want to see from us, so we throw our orb. Mine is a bit better, by the way, if you watch my guide. I start a bit closer to the mid lurk. So when we lurk mid, we get into this smoke. I really want to see you. Before the poison's even out, just walk out, okay? And walk right this way. I want balls of steel. This is like balls of bronze. They're still hard. You've still got big balls. But... Um, they could be even harder. We don't need to walk this wide from this angle. We don't need to worry about this boiler guy getting timing peak on us. I like the round. I like the mid lurk. I would lurk mid even more. Ooh. Yeah, you guys can come B. This is so good for us. Super good for us. Oh, 
He's on your top of yellow. Yeah, that's fine. Good round, good round. We should just be looking tube, okay? So, here our crosshair should just be on tube. Put yourself in the defender's shoes. How often are you gonna be like, oh yeah. Surprise! And you fight the guy. No shot, no shot, right? This is our only danger here, this tube. So our crosshair should just be locked on it. And we're also a little slow, we're losing time. Let's do a timing comparison real quick to see when I would get to tube. If I played this round normally. So we're going under, I'd be coming out around 132. Otherwise I'd probably be peaking tube around a similar time, okay? So right here, I'd be like at this corner of tube peeking it to walk up or coming out of my orb to peak B or A, okay? That difference in pace matters a lot. You're roughly three seconds behind me, okay? And here we see, finally, our crosshair placement bites us. Remember how I mentioned that they're not going to push that, that orb? Tube is dangerous. There they are. See, what are we aiming at? Get out of there, get out of there. I don't like that we held here. So we take these two shots, and then you see how we're keeping this exposed? We should be knifing out and getting up against these uh, blue tubes on our left because we have a classic pistol. This fight's terrible for us. We've already gotten the info. We don't want to give her any shots. And here, I don't like this. Don't give her this fight. So here, if we want to collect info that she's pushing mid or not, which is valid, we want to just hold like tiny pixel. We're not trying to get a kill. We're trying to get info, okay? We'll see her and we'll do this. The fight's bad for us. We're just trying to figure out if she's going to. <laughs> Man, feels good to be so right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We won. Why aren't we buying Spectre or a Marshall and armor? Yeah, and now we're buying a Hero Vandal? Okay. If we're buying Hero Vandal here, which I'm sure you didn't mean to do, you're so asleep. We want to like do something like walking down tube and looking to fast flank and win the team, win the round for our team. This is too passive. And I don't like playing mid and Viper. Unless I'm opping. Otherwise, I like the initiator here, and I prefer we would be long. And remember, we have a Vandal, and our teammates have, like, weaker guns. So we don't want to wait to find a fight. We want to be one of the first people to fight this round. So this is our first fight on our hero Vandal buy round. 2v4. So we don't want to be waiting for our teammates to get all these fights on our hero buy. We want to press the issue. So like I said, you know, maybe push down two. Yeah, did you watch my Icebox guide? Box? Because I don't recall recommending this type of play. Yeah, you're on autopilot this out. I can see it, man. Let's see, how many games did we play this day? Oh, dude, dude, dude. It's our... <laughs> it's our sixth game of the day. Of course we're on autopilot. Yeah, so defense, this is really our biggest issue. Our plans suck. We're throwing good util, because somebody watched a fabulous Viper guide on this map. But our pr positioning, once the round begins, is pretty trash. We didn't buy on our buy round. We've... Bought a hero vandal on our bonus round. And now we keep playing mid. The only time I play mid on Viper, I would play mid this game, by the way. They're not smoking the cross. Buy an op, though. It's in the guide. No autopilot pre round setups need to be well thought out. Plan for the round. Right? I'm not seeing us plan for our round. I'm seeing us just be like, okay, they're A. I'm gonna go A. Oh, okay, they're B. Oh, nobody's mid. I'll play mid. Throw these normal orbs I practice in server time. Well, that, that part's good. <laughs> but you're not playing it like it's a tournament with money on the line. That's what I'm seeing. You know what I'm saying? 